My name is Tim Hubbard. I'm running for Riverhead Town Councilman on the Republican line with endorsements from the Conservative Party, Independent Party, and Reform Party. I am a father of five children, husband, community member, neighbor, and friend of the people of Town of Riverhead. I grew up in the Town of Riverhead. I was uh, employed by the Riverhead Town Police Department for 32 years. I retired as a detective first grade. My roots run very deep in this community. Uh, generations and generations of Hubbards before me, a lot of them working in public service. And I've made a, a career of working in public service as 32 years as a police officer. Uh, my involvement in the Police Athletic League, my involvement when I was elected to the, to the Riverhead Town School Board, these are all things that have helped me develop a keen sense of the town of Riverhead of what goes on in the town of Riverhead and maybe some changes that I'd like to help to put forward for the town of Riverhead if I should be privileged enough to get elected as your town councilman. I'm most proud of the fact that I spent 32 years working as a police officer. When you work as a police officer you wear many hats. Uh, one day you're a minister, maybe you're a lawyer, maybe you're a doctor, maybe you're a social worker and wearing those different hats and dealing with the people in the town of Riverhead really gives you a great sense of the needs of the people and what Riverhead is all about. And I'm very proud of my accomplishments there. Um, I've won numerous awards. I had uh, multiple parts of training from the advanced FBI crime prevention uh, class that I took to my work as a juvenile officer and work with the Police Athletic League in the town. Well, I've been, as I mentioned, a school board member. I, I ran for election there. I worked with budgets in excess of $100 million. I'm proud of my work on the school board because we were able to maintain the necessities for the children, for the district, for their great education, while also keeping a lid on the taxes for the people of the community. My work on the Eastern Suffolk BOCES Advisory Board helped me uh, put into effect some some legislation or some, some rules regarding weapons possessions in the schools. We hit that very hard years ago and set a tone that Riverhead would not accept weapons in the schools and we did very well by that. My work on the PBA board allowed me to work with the town and work with contracts, uh, budgets, and it makes me very, very comfortable in approaching the town councilman's position. I think the biggest issue facing the town right now is its financial situation. Uh, Supervisor Walter just put forth a, a budget for the year 2016 that includes a little bit over of a 5% tax increase. Riverhead needs to develop more revenue and we need to work on getting more grants. We need to offset some of the money coming in as opposed to the money going out. It's a very sim simple line of logic if you think you can't spend more than you make and unfortunately we've been caught up with some things where we've been sp spending more than we've been bringing in. Also with the development of EPCAL. Uh, with the subdivision map coming hopefully to fruition by the end of this year, we should be able to market some of that land up there and that will also bring revenue into the town. I know this has been a very long process and I don't expect it to happen overnight now either, but it is a lot closer to coming to a head than it ever has been. So that will also help bring revenue in for the town of Riverhead.